Recital outfit this week. Thank you. Oh, wow, that's a nice shot. Feeling with no makeup on, that's when you're the prettiest. I hope that you don't take it wrong. This is my favorite flower. Can you guess what it's gonna be? I meant to put this plate on. That's good enough. That was nice. <laughs> I meant to put the hoodie on before the plate. So I put her hair up in a ponytail. Put your head down. Then I, this is what it looks like. I'm gonna put this in a bun. One, two, three. I just did his curls. You don't know, baby, when you hold me. Most of the donut is done, but we're having a hard time fitting this little bit in there because it's so, so much hair up under there, so. And it don't change if I had it my way Cause you would know that you The copy that I need in the morning. You're my sunshine in the rain when it's pouring. Won't you give yourself to me? Give it all. Oh, I just want to see. I just want to see how beautiful you are. You know that I see it. I know you're the star. Where you go, I follow. No matter how far. She's fine too, but I want you. Ha, 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 ha. She's fine too, but I want you to love me even more. So let's see how you like this song. Yeah. <laughs> now don't go Big time on timer. Woody, Now we're reading words. Oh, she. Where? This little person? I know. They are too small to be walking by themselves. I wonder if people look at me and think that. <laughs> like, look at this baby right <laughs> having to go to the grocery store <laughs> that's a grown woman exactly it's a rainy day the kids are asleep there's a cupcake on her head bye dr shoes uh, so there's no turn up dang that bitch this morning in this vehicle. Three little birds sat on my window and they told me I don't need to worry. Uh. The more they stay the same, ooh, don't, don't you think it's strange? Girl, put your records on. Tell me your favorite song. Somewhere, somehow. That's how I feel about getting on time to work. <laughs> I'll get there somewhere. Somehow. You have to break the system. If no. you guys want to be sheeple, go ahead and be on no. time. No. If you want to be, be on long, time. Be strong, mm -hmm. leader like me. Be on, be on time. Best wake day up, ever. Wake up. It's the first of the month. Get up, get up, get up. Catch your check and get on. Wake up, wake up, wake up. What do you even know about that? Good morning again, Bailey. Wake up. Come on, it's time, y'all. Don't be eating them sprinkles off your head. Bailey, don't mess up your hair. Come on, wake up. We're about to walk out. Best day ever, right, Moses? They're letting us go. Thank you. See, people, there are good people in this world.
This salad tastes like chocolate, just so you know. Like, I'm not being funny. I don't know why it tastes like chocolate. Oh, yeah. He was, um... First of all, let me say this is my cheat day. And all I've had today was, um, a salad in bed and, uh, fruit. And I'm not eating all these. This one's gonna eat a lot of them, too. I'm eating all of them. And I'm just gonna have a few. Just a tiny amount. Matter of fact, she's just gonna whiff it. Get the essence of it. No, I'm gonna eat some <laughs> of it. She said it needed more ranch. This is what we do when one of us is driving, the other one feeds the other person. Might cover it a lot more. A lot more? Yeah, just like get half of it in there. Okay, I'm like that? Yeah. Oh, perfect. You want me to just hand it to you? Yeah. Okay, let me let it stop dripping. Ooh, it's a bit hot. I think my favorite part of um oh, my favorite part of being in elementary, I was on both sides of it. But when I was like in the like younger I was looking for my phone. ages, <laughs> then we'd have like the buddies. So it'd be like mm -hmm. the fifth graders would go to the first graders and then like read to them. Would they? Yeah. I need something to drink. Um, I got. Do they have like a vending machine in in the taekwondo place? I don't know. Places like that usually do, but if oh, yeah, not, they do. She said, "I don't know." Right. Like, if not, we gonna have to DoorDash it. Um, right. side of it. But I'm I'm sure like places like this are usually in like tiny shopping centers. Chicken, 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 chicken. How do you say that? You gotta be cool. <laughs> In one mile, turn right to merge onto I-225 South. You want the chicken? What do you want? It doesn't say chicken. I want the ranch and the fries. Just kidding. I don't need it. I can wait till I drop. Are you sure? Chicken, chicken, chicken. Okay, so the kid said, what happened in the gym? I hope what the teenagers scared of. I mean me. So they had it decorated like a haunted house, right? Yeah, there's a whole bunch of smoke. Fake fire. Were they dressed up scary? Yeah. yeah. One of them were following me when I was leaving because it was like, you have to run. And I was like, <laughs> They wanted you to run. <laughs> I was like, <laughs> They are smashing this chicken in the back, by the way. Right. That's your second piece. I taught them how to eat chicken so that there's no chicken left on the bone. That would be funny. Thank you. These are um, cute. I'd be a scary actor. They be loving their job. Just scaring, Do they? Scaring, Just scaring scares. people till you yeah. get hit. Ah, boop. Oh. Like, <laughs> <laughs> I guess they got like everybody got like a certain contract. Also, if you got like an X on you or like some like wristband, mm -hmm. then like you can't be touched or scared. I don't know. You're done, baby. Mm -hmm. Okay, give me your bone. You got Shoot. a lot of meat on that. I still be a scare actor, and I'm not even Good a real job, scare guys. actor. Let me find you some paper towel. So today you guys get your um, uniforms. Are you excited? Yeah. Bailey, do you want to not do it? I want to. Because I was thinking it might be too much for you. Everybody keeps saying it might be too much if you do martial arts. Okay. I said, I was like, she really wants to do it. So Guys, this is documented proof. We're going to try it out. I can't wait to be able to make a movie, y'all. Like... That's what my degree is in, and I'm just so excited to be able to make movies. I was just finna pick him up, and then I was finna like, not mock, but I was finna like make him pretend that he was saying what you were saying. Are you just gonna mock me? Not mock, but like. I'm just trying to like air the car out so we don't go in here smelling like chicken. <laughs> Piece of chicken. Piece of chicken. Go past this light. Then at the next one, turn right. Ooh, my bones. It's because it's cold, y'all. You, you are too young to say <laughs> that. Abandoned ship. Abandoned ship. Here's the ship, and we jump. Jump. Y'all got candy back there? Yeah. You can edit that out. No, I'm not editing nothing. At the light, <laughs> use the right lane to merge onto I-225 South. W's I dealt with for my daughter. Um, Actually, I make her life way more fun. What kind of gum? Can I see what type of candy y'all have? I was finna say I need to inspect y'all's candy. Well, it came from teachers. Yeah, for you, mommy. Thank you, baby. I'm only gonna take one for now, though, okay? Okay. 
But also, I did buy you guys candy too. Really? How many? Yeah, in I that have? big old box. First. I see the taste of candy. Yeah, there's a bag of candy in there and some toys. This dude, he was sitting on the side of the street selling them. So we stopped and went in there. Yeah, we got, it was cold too. What? Why are you looking so <laughs> goofy? What? What? <laughs> Nothing. Me and my guys, we was having a conversation. You was talking to my blood? Yeah. You'll see it when you edit it. Oh, hell. <laughs> Just know I'm telling all, all three of y'all. Me? Oh, just kidding. Do you want some candy? Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> you want some? Don't lick me. <laughs> I hate when you be somebody and they lip like touches your finger or they like lick you on the way. Like that's how you show your appreciation. Let me show you what it looks like out here. Cold and gloomy. I have on a what onesie because right. right. I have a what? What? It's like slow. What the f you see? Take the exit, yeah. then it's keep like right onto State Highway 83 actually. North. Slow down, sweetie. Look at these paintings. Their faces painted. Hang on, can I go? Like, go turn it to me real quick. Hold up. <laughs> you can. But I was trying to get you your uniforms first. You can. Let me see your donut. Okay, you can get started. Love you. You're missing out. Mm -hmm. May just oh, that's really good. Freezing. What is Keon gonna be? Mm -hmm. <laughs> I might force him to be a clown too. Mm -hmm. You're supposed to dress as your mate. pork on that for my baby. There is? Yeah. Okay, can you back up? Mm -hmm. Yeah, back up. So it's all in here. Let's see. Let's open it up and see what all is in here. No, I was saying, that's why it came to your rescue. Harley Quinn don't have buns. Harley Quinn is getting her hair parted. Let me see you. Sir, um, what you got? Two mushrooms, ma ma not mushrooms. Two mush, um, not mush. Uh, Mushroom. Mushrooms. Do -do 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 -do. Can I? Can you eat one so I can see you grow? I can't eat them. Don't. Over there, let me see you stand. You look so cute. Look at you. 
Look at that baby. <laughs> you guys are super cute. You are too, buddy. Thank you, but you guys have on costumes. I don't have one. You actually, I wonder where you ever have the costume. Once you go, when you go, it's like. I know, I never have a costume, huh? Bailey, your hair looks super long all of a sudden. What did Kine do? Brazilian blowout. Drop a kick it to the throat. Yeah. You gotta see. You gotta like, my ponytail off. Get some costumes. So. Yeah, you wanna get me a costume, Wait, Mama, so? When I do this, can you add the sound of What? Harley Quinn, wait. Moses say, here we go. Here we go. <sighs> Castor oil. Toothbrush. Sometimes people will like know that you are in a good place and just want to ruin that for you. This is why no one, I don't deal with nobody. Like, no one has gotten close to me in a very long time. Because, like, I don't want to be toxic. That ain't fun. That's not the move. There's a lot of things about life that, like, at this late age, I still don't understand. Like, I don't understand why anybody would choose to have a negative mindset. I'm extremely tired. The winter, which is approaching here, but I'm not doing anything until I know it's right. It has to be a million percent right. Like, all signs point to hell yeah. The things that you can't share on your vlogs. Putting oil on your scalp. There's just spiritual attributes. I didn't sleep good last night. I was up at like two and then i was just up to like six and then finally when it was time to wake up the kids i was able to fall back asleep but i was like fighting it because i knew i needed to you know get them dressed and everything maybe i'll take a nap and then do our episode go to the gym like, i'm not i don't have an ego like that like if i'm a fan of yours i'm gonna tell you i don't care if you're like the the drug addict down the street you know for me no one has a bigger title in life. No one is bigger than the next person in life. You know, we're all just spirits in these bodies. And whatever you're doing, you could very much be a super dope individual that just does something that I don't understand or I don't agree with or that I would never do. But I could still be a fan of yours and think, you know what? You have an amazing spirit. I like you're super dope you're a dope individual you're just so smart you're intelligent you've probably been through a lot of stuff and have a lot of knowledge and wisdom I've never been one to like judge anybody based off of what they choose to put in their body or how they choose to cope because life is hard life is super hard just because I don't drink or smoke you know that's a choice that I chose to make but um Whatever people do, sometimes people do hard drugs. You know, I've had friends that did hard drugs and that's just where they were at in their life at that moment. I'm not, who am I? I'm not judging you. And if I love you, I love you. I don't, you, it's your body. I don't know, you know. I mean, it took me a while to get here. Don't get me wrong, because I, I used to think differently of it. But now I'm like, no, if I love you, I love you. It's your body. I don't have anything to do with that it's not affecting me i'm more like how do you treat me and how transparent are you you can't start drinking and be like okay now i'm gonna treat you bad you know or like talking to me crazy or sideways you know i always pride myself on being intelligent i'm told that i'm a great mother that i'm intelligent a lot in my life people will hit me up out of nowhere and be like hey I just wanted to tell you that you're so dope to me. Just stuff like that. So, like, if you come into my life and you try to, like, change that or start to say, like, because you're upset one day, like, 
I'm slow because you can't communicate or, you know, like, oh, if you can't comprehend what I'm saying, then I'm not, then, it, you know, like, mm -mm, baby, I, I can very much comprehend. <laughs> like, that's never been me. Ugh. That's not a turn on for me. If we can't be like super best friends and just be closer than ever, the highest frequency is actually your, being your authentic self. Um, so when you're in your authenticity, then you are loved, like you have a real, true, genuine love. That frequency, you could just take over the world. Like as a couple, like you, you manifest, you're going to go, it's through the roof. Um, so I would never get in a relationship if I couldn't level up. Like I'm already at high frequency, so I can't go down. Duh. Like um, my goal is to go up. So if getting in that relationship, we're close friends, we're genuine, we genuinely love each other. When I'm like, hey, there's an issue, you're like, oh yeah, babe, I got you. No problem. That, to me, is princess treatment. And I actually don't even necessarily care what my mate looks like. But yeah, I find different flaws very beautiful. So, like, it could be your insecurity that you think is horrible, like your huge ears or something. And then I'm around you for so long, then I'm like... But it's your signature, it's your scent, it's your smell, it's your personality, it's who you are. So, those things, those same things could piss me off once we break up, too. Like, you can have, like, a super raspy voice, and then, like, now my son is super raspy, and, you know, it's like, hmm, don't be offended, because I'm just using that as an example. True story. <laughs> I also don't think about, um, a man needs to be completely dressed to a T all the time. That don't mean nothing to me. That don't mean nothing to me. Like you could have you could have money, you could be dressed to a T, you could have all these things, but you could be a horrible person and treat me like you could be a horrible father, you could be a piece of like there's those things don't mean anything to me. If obviously I want to see my man dressed up nice sometimes, but that's more like, you know, suit and tie and, you know, dressed up. Um but like it doesn't matter to me if you have the latest Jordans or you wear the best cologne. A lot of times, um, I'm super sensitive, which a lot of empaths are sensitive to sensitive to scents and fragrances. You know, it's nice to have a man that smells good, but sometimes it could be overwhelming. Um, especially if it's something that just turns my stomach and like you leave my home and it still smells like you. But yeah, when I was um pregnant with Bailey, her dad would wash his hair. And I couldn't stand the scent. I was pregnant. I just couldn't stand it. And I was like, can you not wash your hair? Like, all the time. It's just too much. Um, and there's certain people that till this day, like, their cologne is offensive to me. Um, it's just who I am. For me, like, I would rather smell my man's, like, natural odor than to smell his cologne. And, you know, it's different if we're, like, going on a date. Yeah, let's look the best we can and go out. But, like, just on a daily, you come over in some sweats and just be chilling, no cologne, just um, just my preference. Secure household, a man being in the house, the security that comes with that, the security that comes with the man that leads. You know, those things are more important than... Like, oh, you need to be balling out of control because that's not real. A lot of times men will offer, will ask me to go to dinner with them. And I'm like, no. Because I feel like I can't really get to know you at dinner. If you said a picnic, maybe I would. I'm not someone that needs to be taken out to the most fanciest restaurant. Um, because you could take me out, spend four or five hundred easily um, and be a horrible person but like mm -mm, I don't want to argue with nobody and I'm not gonna argue with anyone um or you can't just say hey you're losing me here and they say I'm sorry you feel that way like let me fix it um I got you because like if you come to me and you're like hey I don't like this 
I don't like how you, you was moving here. I'm gonna be like, all right, bet, I got you. And then we're gonna move on and we're gonna go forward and I'm not gonna, like, I got you. Cause I know you don't like that. Like, why would I keep doing that to someone that I love or that I'm trying to build a team with, like, or a relationship with, like, it's really not that complicated, but everybody has things so screwed up where no one wants to, like, compromise or trust each other or, um, I don't know, it's just not, it's just not how it used to be at all, but also, um, everybody's thinking about the wrong stuff, like, what can you do for me, um, when looks fade definitely looks fade that doesn't matter to me oh, who's at my house is it overcooked it's a little I'm gonna put some lashes on lashes literally like make or break your whole look Do you like my bun or no? I love your bun. I love this hairstyle on you. I like when you do the bun at the top. And I need that earring. Blamed all the problems in the family on Marianne. Let me see. What you know about rolling down in the deep? Spooky, scary, Halloweeny. <laughs> These kids got so much candy. I'm sitting here checking their candy, going through it. London is making some cheeseburgers. This is a lot of candy, y'all. Like, just god the candy. Hi, baby. You want to say hi to my vlog? Yep. Yeah. Well, you don't want to say okay, go upstairs. Come here, you. She could come say hi. Sit down. I want to say hi. Here, hi. Hold it. I'm Harley Quinn. Tell them how your um, how your night was. My night was good. I went trick or treating. So was it the best night or what? The best night. It was really a good night. You know what else I don't trust? What? The candy. Yeah, but like, I'm. I'm making sure it's... The little ones. I don't trust the little ones. But it, that, that was somebody in a different state, baby. Like, I don't trust the little ones. I don't trust these. But, okay, feel this. Because you feel there's, like, air in there. So that means no one's opened it. Okay. And that's what I'm feeling for. And also, it's not... That was in a different... This one doesn't have no air in it. That was in a different state, okay? Okay, this one doesn't have no air in okay. it. Okay. But Bailey, that's why it's mommy's job to do it. So and there does there is air in there. there is so okay. make sure that it's safe for you. Okay? Yeah, I'm gonna you make sure it's relax safe. Relax and you relax, and that's all you do. I think these get degrees in some places, Ooh. but I don't think Colorado was one of them. All right. I don't think this. I don't know. D's get degrees. C's get degrees, but some some colleges it's a D. I mean, some classes it's a D. Well, for like the next semester to like early register, I guess some of the classes you can pass with a D. Apparently, D's get degrees. I think this is my favorite. It's given a bit of like, you owe me some money, but you know, it's cool. I'm not going to get out of character. You just have my money when you have it. You know what I mean? This one is given Beyonce. That new album she did. Get your money while you bullshit. That's cute. No, Especially you gotta with say the, face. the pimp saying while you do it. Oh, um. Study long, you study wrong. Stay ready, you gotta get ready. Trips, making trips. Come back at six, wake me and your child. And then won't play today. Make me wonder who you might have been. Playing with makes me wonder who you think playing with. I'm just a myself to keep playing this. 
back to back over and over again. Sweat change, but I know that's the end. Oh.